We'll be learning about quick mask mode in this section. Great way to refine your selection by using your paintbrush to add or subtract from an existing selection. When in quick mask mode, painting with black will subtract from the selection. Painting with white will add to the selection in quick mask mode. All right, now that'll make sense when we open hippo.jpg uh, here in a second. Now I've started with a, a very crude selection using the lasso tool. I'll go down here to quick mask mode. Now what we'll do in quick mask mode is you'll notice there's a red overlay. Notice that my foreground color, let me make my brush a little bit bigger here, my foreground color is black. With my foreground color as black, I'm able to paint on that red overlay. Okay, and I might not want to uh, use a soft edge brush. I might want to use a hard edge brush here. Okay, I'm painting on that red overlay. So basically, I just want to be able to see the hippo and only the hippo. Now the problem is I need to get rid of this white overlay down here at the bottom. What I'll do is I'll switch my foreground and background colors so that my foreground color is now white. I'll go ahead and just make my brush a little bit larger and I'll click and drag to get rid of that that red overlay down here at the bottom. Okay, Now notice that when I go back into standard mode, which I'll do in just a second here, Okay, I'm refining, still refining my selection. When I go back into standard mode by clicking the edit in standard mode button, my selection has been refined. And I can take this uh, hippo and do anything I want to it. All right, so that's how to use quick mask mode. Go into quick mask mode, refine your selection, go back and edit in standard mode. Now, one other thing I want to tell you here is in, in quick mask mode, double click on the quick mask mode button you can change the color of your quick mask. So I can make the quick mask blue if I wanted to. I'll go ahead and click OK and notice that the quick mask is blue. I can double click on the quick mask mode button again, change the color to yellow. Okay. Now this may be helpful because you may have some things in your image that are red and you may need to change the color of that quick mask.